right, so I have my drink here. I went um, after my glucose test, my three hour glucose test. It was horrible. I had the, the limeade drink and it was just pure sugar. I immediately wanted to like throw up. Um, so I just wanted to get something healthy. Got some Jamba. This is apples and greens. Let me know what you guys get when you guys go to Jamba. That has been like my go-to for the past, I don't even know how long. But in today's video, um, I'm just gonna take you guys through each of my binders and then show you guys a setup. If it needs explaining, then I'll explain it. But if not, then we'll just breeze right through it. So let's go ahead and get started. This one is my new binder that I've added. I started with one, two, three binders, um, my revolving high priority and my bills binder, but now I have two, three, four, five, six. I have six now. <laughs> so this is my self-care binder. It says right here, work hard, love yourself harder. I thought that was very appropriate for this binder. And I got the sticker. It was a freebie from Designs by Counts on Etsy. But let's just go through my envelopes. So I have nails. I haven't been doing my nails lately. I've just been doing it at home because it's just within my budget. And I've just been focusing on my lashes. <laughs> so um, that's nails. I usually just get pedicures majority of the time. So that's for this. Lashes, of course. I did get a fill after my um, testing. Wax. This is for Brazilian waxes or um, for my brows. Skincare. Makeup. Body sculpt. Okay, so don't judge a girl, okay? I tried out the um, butt vacuums, if I think that's what you call it. They're like big suction cups where you put on your butt cheeks and it just vacuums it and kind of lifts it. I guess it's equivalent to like a thousand squats or something. I don't know, but I tried it and it was cool. But of course you have to do like the maintenance. You have to eat clean, drink lots of water, exercise daily, things like that. So um, this is actually for like red light therapy that I want to save up for my face. <clears throat> Or, um, <clears throat> there was this other thing, Colombian, the Colombian wood, I guess it's supposed to help with inflammation. That would probably be good after giving birth to a whole human. So that's body sculpt and beauty tech. I've seen on Amazon, they have like the face mask of the red light therapy that I kind of want to purchase. It had lots of good reviews. So that's for that or any other tech that I see interesting. This binder is now my holiday binder. I don't have all my holiday envelopes here. There are actually two that are on the way today, um, but I just wanted to go ahead and film this. So I have Valentine's Day, holidays, um, this money is actually for Easter, so um, once that envelope comes, then I'll transfer this money to my Easter envelope. And then I have my anniversary envelope, Christmas, and Disney. I've just decided to put it here. I don't know where else to put it. Um, I was going to put it in the long term, but I, I just... I guess it fits better here. And then I'm waiting for my Halloween one, Easter, Mother's Day, and Father's Day envelopes. So this is my holiday binder. Uh, this one right here is my revolving binder. I say revolving and not low, low term, what is it called? <laughs> Short term? <laughs> my not my short term well I mean I guess it could be because I constantly pull out from here so that's why I call it revolving 
um, but it's and I did switch back to the zipper envelopes because I just like the it's just so satisfying but anyway <laughs> I have my boys this is for their spending if they want something toys things whatnot um, I could pull from here I actually added a chores savings challenge for my son so whenever he does chores like around the house he's been helping with like feeding the dog and sweeping lately so I put I would put the money in here and then my envelope my husband if I want to buy him something family time if we want to go to the movies or um, take a trip somewhere to like a museum that's when I would pull out from here. Pet care. Uh, this is for necessities, foods, um, treats, baths, things like that. We do have a dog. Her name is Kaya. And I've had her for 12 years now. So it's been, it's been quite some time. Um, gifts. This is birthday gifts. Aniv oh, not anniversary because I have a whole new envelope in my thing but um wedding gifts baby shower gifts mm, housewarming gifts that's where i would pull from wardrobe this is for me for shoes socks bras pants anything wardrobe related i did pull from here i had like 35 dollars in here and i wanted to purchase um Maternity leggings. <sighs> I'm out of breath. Sorry. Give me a second. <laughs> I wanted to pull, um, get maternity leggings. So I just pulled from here. And I don't think I'm going to stuff this anytime soon. I'm just going to, I don't know, just use my, my normal clothes. My normal, um, and not try to buy any more maternity clothes. <sighs> Hopefully I won't get too big. But yeah, I think I'm going to save this for after I give birth. Home decor. This is not like top top. So if, if I do have extra cash, then I'll put it here. But it's not like a necessity or anything. So home decor. And plus, I don't have any more storage <laughs> for any more home decor. Shop Small is for my Etsy sellers um, or small shops around my town. That's where I would pull from. Okay. Whew. Next up is my Bills Binder. And I love how this looks with the clear glitter gold binder and I just recently got these so I will link um, everything down below if you guys are interested so I have life insurance mortgage I love this color this is the tan color I should have gotten all tan but I just wanted to mix it up but this is so pretty um, phone credit card my only credit card is capital one so that's for that farmer's insurance subscriptions um this is just for my icloud storage for my phone and that's just three dollars so i stuff it in here personal loan okay and that is my bills binder next up this is probably my favorite binder here and it is my long-term high priority. Isn't that beautiful? With the pink and then the pink. Let me open this. The pink right here on the, the flower. So pretty. I love how it ties in so perfectly. But, um... Fitness, wellness, this is, I'm actually saving up for a nutrition nutrition coach um, <clears throat> for after when I give birth. And I've actually saw this nutrition coach um, in 2013, back when I graduated college. 
um, and he helped me lose 40 pounds. Back then, that was my heaviest I've ever been, and he really helped me lose the pounds in like, I want to say less than a year, maybe close to like nine months, excuse me, but I want to do that again, so yeah, that's what I'm saving up for, and I don't know what it is, but every time I get, um, like the laminated vellum envelopes, the top part always flips out. Does that does that happen to anyone else or is that just me? But I don't know. I don't like it. But anyway, so pretty. Medical, this is for like copays for the dentist, doctor visits, prescriptions, things like that. Back to school, this is my son's envelope. Um whatever he needs for school, clothes, um, books, a backpack, a yearbook. He wants to purchase a yearbook. This is where I would pull from getaways, vacations. Our's birthday. This is my son, my four-year-old son. I'm saving up for his birthday already. His birthday is in August. So that's that. And then I also have one for his savings. A's birthday. This is our baby who is not here yet, but um, I don't know if I'll mention his name, but A, A's birthday, and I also have A's savings. Any maintenance. This is for home maintenance, car maintenance. I just thought I'd combine the two. And then YouTube. This is for giveaways or if I need a new microphone, if I want to purchase a new camera. Um, so yeah, this is where I would pull from for YouTube related. Continuing education, I decided not to get an envelope in this for this because, um, this is just for my CBEST and I plan on passing it, hopefully crossing my fingers very soon so that I could start subbing. Um, but yeah, once I pass that, then this envelope will be gone and baby so this is pretty much just saving for um necessities for myself and the new baby so we do need a new like formula dispenser um i need new nursing bras so things like that is for baby okay and then last actually i have one more hold on let me do this first and then I'll do the other one. Uh, my wallet, I did get some new envelopes for this. So they look like this, very minimal, um, but I love it. I love the white with the vellum. This is personal, this is for my personal spending. Home, um, toiletries, toothpaste, detergent, um, I don't know, things like that, dish, soap, um, but I've also wanted to include groceries in this, so it's pretty much combined. Take out my boys. If they want something while we're out, then I would pull from here. Miscellaneous. This is just going to act as a buffer for the rest of my envelopes. And then I have outings. So if there's a week where we can go out and do something together, then I would pull from here. And I still have my giving, and then I have my miscellaneous. This acts as a um, back to the bank envelope. So, yeah, that is my wallet. And then my last one, this is actually an A5 binder. And I saw this idea from Magnolia Budgets. She called it her manifestation binder, and that's what I'm calling this as well. So, idea came from her. I saw it from her first. Uh, so, I'm sure lots of people do this, but this is like manifestation binder and long term slash long term. So, in here, I have my emergency. Um, the goal for this is 5k. That's what I want to save up. 
I also have an envelope for my kids' grad fund. So <clears throat> in total, I want to save 5K, but like not 5K, sorry, 10K total, but 5K for each kit. So this could go towards a registration for college, senior pictures, um, their senior trip, their cap and gown, you know, things like that. This one right here is dream home. So <clears throat> the house that we live in now, um, it is quite small and there's not a lot of storage. Right now we live, there's three adults and one child, about to be two kids. And we have three bedrooms, one bath. One bath is just, it's not going to do it. It's it's so hard getting ready in the morning. We all work. We pretty much work like at the same time, eight o'clock. And it's so hard to get in and out. I have to wake up early, like an hour and a half early just to get in and get ready. And then our roommate gets up. My son has to pee in the morning and it's just, it's a hassle. So what I was thinking for dream home, this would either be for a down payment for a new house or to renovate this house and add an extra bathroom and possibly some more storage because we don't have a lot of storage. Um, our house is like a bungalow style, uh, so we don't have a garage. It's just like a, a carport and it just would be nice. So the goal for this one is 15K. That's really high up there, but I know I could do it. So that's that. And then this one, transformation, this is for myself, okay? Transformation, I'm gonna have two babies. Who knows if I'm gonna have saggy skin, boobs down to my knees, I don't know. But, <laughs> and I know I do have a, I have an envelope for fitness and all that stuff. I don't mind working for my body. I've done it before. I've entered a bikini competition um, before and I know how hard it is and how much dedication and willpower it takes to, um, you know, work for your body. But sometimes exercise and eating right won't get rid of saggy skin. So that's where this comes in. This is like a mommy makeover envelope, I guess you guys could say. The goal for this is 20K, um, but I would definitely work for my body first. And if, you know, I don't need this, then I won't use it. But if I feel like, okay, maybe I could tweak, I don't know, improve myself, my confidence, then I'll I use it. I have no problem. I don't see what the big deal is when there are girls, ladies who do surgery to feel confident. I don't see a problem with that, honestly. If it makes you feel good, why not? So that's that. I mean, I yeah, I did a bikini competition once. I could show you guys a picture. No big deal. I showed my ass to like the whole world. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's that's pretty much it for my binders, my whole setup for 2023. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, if you guys have any other questions about, you know, my whole setup or an envelope that you're curious about that I didn't explain, then feel free to comment down below. Um, but yeah, other than that, I didn't want to keep this video too long. So I'm just going to end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, the whole deal. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Take care.